What's the dealio, Montilio, y'all? Before we get into this video, I just want to say this video is brought to you and sponsored to you by Galeana's Van Dyke Dodge. You know what I'm saying? Even though I got a vet, I'm still a Mopar till I D.I.E., baby. Look, look at this. You see, Mopar service with a Corvette inside the Mopar service thing. Galeana's treat me right, always going to treat me right. So, make sure you come up here. That's where I got the red eye. I got the... Well, I'm gonna get a TRX, I'm gonna get a Durango Hellcat. That's where you can get a Hellcat, a Scat, even a 5.7 to a minivan. Make sure you ask for Therese when you do. And then we go over into parts, literally, you know what I'm saying, go in here. And then you can get 15% off all parts, prove you Saint Squad, man. So go ahead, Galeana's Van Dyke Dodge and more in Michigan. Now let's get into this banger video. What's the dealio, Martilio, y'all? Come to y'all with another banger video, as always, man. And right now, I'm, I'm a little nervous, okay? I'm just a tad bit nervous. Because last night I kept losing air in the tire. I'm in... Okay, it does look like it's getting flat. Anyways, y'all, last night I feel like I ran over a nail or something in my tire. But look at this. Okay, look. We're going to start the video off like this. See the tent? I need a wash, though, because it got caught in the rain. Again, I don't know why it's raining so much. But, um, yeah. Yeah, so something's going on. You know what I'm saying? So look at that tire. We'll look at this one. Nice. But this this one. Yeah, I, I don't know what's going on. At least it's not like all the way flat, but it's down there. So I looked everywhere last night. I didn't find a nail. And then yeah, whatever. So we about to start up the big Betty right now. Then we're gonna head up and get this situation fixed because I'm kinda sick and I'm really sick because these are like really good tires and I don't know where to get these and they might be expensive. So yes, sir. All those go off, don't worry, you know what I'm saying? You see that? All those go off, but you know. Jesus, five PSI? What the heck, dude? We gotta get this fixed ASAP, no Rocky. Okay, so it's at 31. Hopefully, that'll last me. All right, y'all, so y'all see, I have left the vet up here at Bell Tire. Well, I'm leaving up here at Bell Tire. My mom's on her way to come pick me up. Now, hopefully they can fix it and stuff. If don't see a nail, if they can patch it, patch it that'd be cool i'm really hoping it's not the room because these rooms like crack very easily so he said he's gonna give me a call when you do i'm only leaving it up here for a little bit my mom has to give me just because he said he it's only a certain few people he trusts back there that work on like expensive and stuff cars like these which i really appreciate it and i understand that so we got to leave the vet up here man which is like eh. but we'll be all right because we do have some errands to run anyway but we are stuck with just this one key which i know this is why you clicked on this video y'all which i can't i'm not gonna get you know what i'm saying we're gonna wait to show y'all all the new pictures yes we have new pictures and everything of the red eye and i, I don't know y'all just gonna see but we are leaving betty up here right now and hopefully this gets figured out because i don't know hopefully it's just a nail and they could patch it but that tire stuff bad make sure y'all deal with that stuff so i'm gonna just go you know what i'm saying while I wait for my mom, you know, carless again. No, my one car is there. My other one is burnt down in a construction yard in New Mexico. Yep. That, and we're just sitting on benches right now, just waiting for a Cadillac to drive past. He gonna do it and everything. Well, y'all. So Bell Tire called me and they said that my room it's actually cracked which is like what the heck so i guess it happened yesterday or whatever but it happens to chevy's you know what i'm saying now i gotta go on my little chevy slander and stuff oh <laughs> but yeah now i gotta go on my little chevy slander and stuff because you know th that happened to ty it happened to my mom rims only crack on chevy's the big red eye would never do that you know what i'm saying it it really wouldn't do that so we're going to this meeting for the merch and everything right now and then after that, we're going back up there, and my dad should be able to fix the crack room. So we'll see. All right, y'all, and we are back with the vet. So they could have fixed it because, like I said, it's a crack. And he said the crack is on the inside of the room. It's like a little hairline crack on the inside of the room and stuff. But my dad is going to fix it for me, actually. So we're going to get the vet to my dad's, and they got to sit overnight. So one of these days, not one of these days, but hopefully, like, tomorrow or soon or something, because you could tell it's already, like, flatter than you could tell from the front to this is going down and 
I hate literally having to deal with this stuff. It's literally, this is a Chevy thing, because the same thing happened in Ty. I remember Ty cracked his rim. Whew. Chevys. Mopar would never. So anyway, so I guess we'll go back home now or whatever. But we do have some news that me and my mom are going to talk to you about. We got some new news, actually some new pictures of Big Red Eye. So I'm excited to show y'all that. And I know that's what y'all clicked on this video for. So let's head back home and check it out, man. Well, I ain't been in here in a minute. <laughs> you like that voice sound good, don't it? I got it. I don't. I'm a safe driver. I'm a safe driver, Chevy. Don't worry. Don't worry, buddy. We safe. Y'all thought I was going home. I'm going to Galliana. So six psi, no cap. Smart or dumb? Comment down below. Let me know. What is going on here, dude? What 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 the heck is this? Galliana's. What what is going on here, dude? Like you you just can't be serious. I have made it inside though, y'all. From the looks of this, this thing, look, I'm doing coolie. All these engine lights, I got the engine light on, I need the tune. No tuner wanna hit me back. So I'm going to Marco's appointment with him and I'm getting the tune also. Just letting you know, just letting y'all know, say squad, cause we can't, we we don't need that. And then that is, my dad will fix that tomorrow. But I, I need air in the tire at least, dude. It was literally, once it gets below five, it gets bad. At five, it's like normal, below five, then you feel it wobble. You know what I got here on? What? Two PSI. Did you hear that? What? He got here on 2 PSI. A what? He got here on 2 PSI on the tire. There's a crack in the rim. So he, he has run the class. You like that. Look, it's leaning a little bit. If you like, look carefully. Yeah, it's this that one. This one got stock exhaust. Yeah. <laughs> That's the Big T? It's like, no. You like that. <laughs> no, Go ahead. I can't, I can't, I can't repeat that again. Bro, can't repeat that again. the camera not on, bro. Oh, okay. Alright, we're good. So, for the interview, they're gonna ask you. Man. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Do y'all hear that same spot? You can hear it like sizzling out. Like, I let me put y'all closer wherever I think it is. You hear it? Get, get, get closer, closer to it. Bro. Bro, <laughs> bro, we gotta go see Josh. Come on, <laughs> we, we gotta Come go on. see Josh. <laughs> Leaving Galliana's, and this is what we have to deal with, dude. Shout out to James. You no know, more parts came handy. Literally, this this is like getting really bad. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna for sure have to like go buy a new rim. Like I I can't keep doing this, dude. I right, having to deal with this. Uh uh, Chevy, because I know any slight pothole hit, you know what I'm saying, and rim crack. It's a Chevy thing. But look at James coming through. You like that. And he, but yeah, I'm gonna have to do it. that. Look at Therese coming to the rescue too. But anyway, so I know what y'all been waiting for and everything, but with the pictures and stuff. So I just want to wait till we go home. My mom talked about it. We all talk about it and stuff. And we figure out like, we y'all gonna see. Now we rush home and make sure that doesn't go out before we get home. And we are back at home, Saint Squad. So I know what you guys clicked on this video for, what you clicked, the thumbnail, the title, and all that stuff. And we are finally going to talk about this after we went through the hardships with the vet today. We're just going to have to buy another room, so just stay tuned for that. But now we are going to talk about that. Yes, I set up a ring light for this. Just... just Y'all need the good light. That, that's just how it works. Y'all not gonna watch if it look ugly, so I got a ring light for y'all. Anyways, y'all, so today we were updated with some new pictures of Big Red Eye. So we got some new pictures of it, not the four that we seen, especially and the one on the truck and trailer, especially not the four that some people think are photoshopped for some reason and think I would fake it or think it would be insurance job. So I told a five-star company who contracted with someone else to you know blow up 68 911 Porsche and 55 Chevelle because I, I did I didn't I wasn't smart enough to know that my car is worth maybe 90 through 100,000 because of the car market but instead of selling it I just decided to get screwed over by an insurance company who's probably going to try to 
just pay out what I owe. You know, I'm saying I'm not, I guess I'm not that smart for those type of people. But anyways, we're going to get past that. So we got more updated pictures of Big Red Eye and we're going to go through them all together because it's like 11 of them, I think. Yeah, it's like 11. We got these pictures and it was interesting. So we were like, okay, check this out. So um, I'm going to also put them up here on the screen too, just in case you guys can't see it. It's good. But um, so this is one of the first pictures we have. I'm gonna make sure, you know, it might be little edit parts in here because there's some information and stuff in here. And we honestly, me, Saint Squad, they're doing the right thing so far, but if they don't, then I'm gonna release the names and everything. So make sure y'all don't get messed over by anyone not doing the right part. So I'm gonna cut that out. When you're a powerful man, you know your words can mean something. So we're just gonna keep it cordial right now. Thank you. <laughs> right, right so here we have a new picture this is our first time seeing the inside, inside. so now you go up close you could really see well actually boom put it on the screen but. i was like to i was like totally stuck because it's, it's it's i mean it's damaged of course but it's, it's recognizable i don't know if i expected to see like everything charcoal burnt yeah like, i expected yeah. to see like all that all blacked out yeah exactly like like burnt or something so the fact that it isn't um i mean it's damaged of course but it, it definitely i was shocked to see it in this in this condition yeah so it, honestly you can see the steering wheel it still has the alcantara on there but you can see on the inside where it's still like a little blacked out and stuff yeah. also yeah so it's it's definitely damaged but like i said when i when i thought that i don't know i thought i would saw charcoal crispy seats but You're right that's not the case all right moving on to the next one this yeah. just shows like the door panel and stuff right here but you can see my mask is still And intact. your hand sanitizer's good job. No, nah, that looked burnt. That boy looked like it fizzled up or something. Well, it might have, but I'm just saying the that fact boy. that you had some. But yeah, but they said my window broke, with, like my window shattered, which I believe because they kept the window down when it was transformed. That's why I believe like that shattered yeah. like on the inside for the heat. like right over here that's kind of like yeah. whatever that is. Yeah, and you can see the controller to the stars. That looks yeah. like it's intact also. So Okay, so this shows the headliner. So it looks like, like you would say, like you would see, it looks a little bit decent on the inside, but then you can see, look at the lights right there. They're supposed to be like a bright, it's like a whitest oh. instead of that. You can see how like the lights is like doo-doo yellow. Like you ain't drink well, water and like, you didn't drink water in two months and you peed. That's what the lights yeah, look like. Why you that look, look. Be like doo -doo yellow. That I mean, just like not bright. Them lights mm -hmm. look nasty. So but you can yeah. see, I guess they're showing the headliner here because I, I was talking to the uh, guy who inspected it and stuff. Shout out to him. He was really cool. And his son actually commented on the community tab. So shout out to you also. I appreciate it. We were talking about, I told him about the headliner and all that stuff. So I guess that's proven that as well. So here we see another front side of the outside. And I didn't see this at first, but you can see like on the hood where the wrap is like blistering up. I'm yeah. sorry that because it starts to look nasty once he gets pictures up close to it and stuff. But you can see the headlights are literally like black through. Oh, I didn't even notice that on the picture before. Yeah, I see that. I'm going gonna, yeah. gonna to go up a little bit so we can see this crispiness on the... <laughs> oh, look at this. Yeah, up so, there. It's uh, literally all blistered up there. It's disgusting. It's, 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 <laughs> it's all blistered up there. You can see it's blistered right here. You can see... Wait, keep it right there. You No, no, no. Right there. You can see, like, the vents and stuff. Oh, the plastic yeah. on the vents is, like, molded. It's, right like, here. melted. Right there is melted and stuff. You can see right there it went straight through the wrap and the paint. It got it got messed up pretty bad. She told us the front also has severe damage. So we didn't see under the hood. I forgot the email and asked for that if they did take one. But I'm pretty sure all of the wires, all of the everything under there. But like, I don't know. It's just completely melted. I'm pretty sure it won't start either. Some people asked about that also when I showed a sneak peek on Instagram. Oh, ask about what? Say it again. If it started. I'm pretty sure oh. it won't because all the wires, everything electrical is probably mm -hmm. melted. Okay, now this is one of those disgusting ones right here y'all look at this that looks foul because it looked like blisters like human blisters so you see this all right here is literally like yeah. through ski that's through that look like blisters and stuff the whole wrap on the side is through that's interesting like what what made it do that like blister up like like 
you know, mm-hmm. like, like almost nails, you know, when I, after you, you paint over your nail in the house and the nails start to protrude out of the, the wood and all that kind of stuff. That's, that's, I don't know why I would do that. Yeah. But that like this yeah, looks crazy. disgusting. So we are back on the inside, y'all. And this is the back seat, which, you know, everything, it looks all intact on the inside for some reason. But you can still see like a little bit of like where the charcoal oh, hit that. it and stuff. Yeah, like you can see the blackness of like the smoke just being inside it, it being engulfed. Now it looks decent, but they are, we already know that smell will literally never go away. Like it probably stinks in there. Like it stank, you know. <laughs> it stank it. It probably stinks in there, y'all. No. So yeah, that's yeah. That, yeah, look at this too. Mm-hmm. Wow. Just look out right there. Right. Look at the window on this side. You can't see the windows, but they look like they're like frosted. Yeah. <laughs> you nope. can't really see what it's. Uh... Yeah, that's interesting. Whoa. Backside looks terrible, y'all. Like this is one of those dramatic, terrible-looking backsides that I see. Is like, while y'all looking at it, I'm looking at it too. But like, jeez, you it, you can tell where it happened. Literally, the whole back bumper is melted. These tips were chrome. They look black now. These are chrome five-inch tips. I mean, at least the freaking frame bar is. Right, Whatever. it's like you could just put a water hose on it, it'll be clean. That's, but I mean, look at that, it just even, I mean, all of this is like dragging. I mean, that's, mm -hmm. you know, like, like that, that is crazy. Yeah, yeah all of that, good. like, literally melted, Saint Squad. So, as you see, you see the tail light is melted. The wing, is the spoiler is melted with the wicker bill was probably like, Dissipated, the tits the tits of pain, it, it, through the air, through the fire type. Like, this thing is literally, y'all. Uh, now, this is like, makes it look worse. I bet you all those wires are just through. Literally, all the wires in the back is just through ski. That's something you, I, you, I wouldn't want to fix. Right here on this one, you guys can see like the blistering. Like how it blistered, like dude, it looks like human skin or some type of skin. Like it doesn't look like a rat. Like the glass started to shatter here. Oh yeah, I didn't even see that. The glass started to break mm -hmm. right there. Hold on. Right here. Right. Okay, let's see. All right, go over again. Yeah, like the glass. I didn't even see that. The glass started to break right there. Dude, that just looks disgusting, like human skin blistering or something. Like that little thingy that's on the top is gone. Oh, the that antenna. Is... Oh, antenna. Is that what? Yeah. <laughs> that little that's thingy why my Uconnect couldn't pick up the car when I kept trying to. Oh. I kept trying to Uconnect in LA and it wasn't picking it up. Cause the antenna was gone. Mm -hmm. it was like it got a hole right there. Yeah, all of that. Crunchy crispiness. Yeah, that looks disgusting. Yeah, I and think... that went straight through the paint. You could you could literally see that. We see another shot of it like this. Uh, it's like another front shot. This is where you can really tell like the front. You can see it went straight to the paint right there. The blacked out headlights. The rims. It, it's still the rims. The tires are still intact. I don't know how. Don't ask me how, but they are right. I bet you the brakes is all right too. But th this side doesn't look as bad as the other side. But still mm -hmm. looks. It's just messed up, dude. Look at the mirror folded up. And then this light, I, don't, I wonder why this side of the windshield looks so different. I, it, it's, it's, it's really weird. You know what I mean? It's, it's like, I don't know. It's weird that, you know, I, well, I don't know how fire, smoldering fire, soot, dirt, and all that stuff work, but um, that like these would just black out. So I wonder if the engine is, you know what I mean? If the engine caught off, I don't know, but anyway. This is the picture that I teased on my Instagram. So follow me on Instagram, at Josh Laurent with two T's, man. I said this looks disgusting because this literally looks like somebody's skin who has dry skin and you could just peel it off. You see it crack the wrap, crack the paint. It goes straight through the paint, dude. That's like why it's white right there. And it took like a big chunk out right here. Like this literally looks disgusting. You see the top of the uh, the top of the spoiler is through. Like literally, it is destroyed. Dude. Yeah, that's not that's interesting. That's like straight to the to the 
so whatever the car made out of, that's what it is. Look like a meteorite. <laughs> like this thing is literally yeah, through. Look at that door handle right here and stuff. Yeah, this is, it's not looking good, Saint Squad. Here we have another shot of the back of it, and yeah, like I said, the tips is chrome. They black. You see this like little wire come down. Like what is that? But like it's like. It looks like it's like it ends, like it, the end of it got burnt off. You see the bumper literally disintegrated. My license plate is gone. You know what I'm saying? The license plate be expensive itself, but yeah, it is. Um, the, I this guess picture, it's in the bottom of the trailer, huh? This picture just shows like yeah. I mean, so it was definitely saw. the the back of some sort, but it even looks like on this side maybe. If the car is in this way, if something impacted it from the side, I don't know. It's what? just that. No, nothing hit it on the side. Mom. No, I didn't say hit it on the side. I said maybe whatever happened was more on this side. I didn't say anything hit it. So, well, I mean, yeah, these are, I mean, anything that I guess provides a little bit more insight as to what happened, it still will be interesting to see the report itself. So for the report from the driver, the report from the um, uh, police department, that type of stuff, because this is the result of something happening. Fire, obviously. But I mean, something else, what? Did another car happen? Was there some impact, you know, that caused it? So the details, I think, is what we're looking for next. But this is also just... You know, extra stuff. Yeah, but we just want to show y'all, well, you know what I'm saying, because y'all are very invested into this, and I appreciate y'all saying squad. So we just showed y'all the extra pictures that we have, and we're telling you everything. Everything that was in there. 68 911 Porsche, 55 Chevelle Super Sport, literally classic cars in there. He said the cheapest car in there was a Tesla. Now think about that. The cheapest car in that trailer was a Tesla, dude. A Tesla? But that was literally all the new pictures we just got of it. And it is insane. I don't know what to think. It looked disgusting. It looked like skin. I don't like looking at those pictures. It makes me feel like I'm going to throw up. It's just nasty. But I just wanted to share that with y'all at Saint Squad because I know y'all would enjoy seeing the new pictures, the new everything of the big red eye and seeing what really happened y'all and i'm gonna always keep y'all up to date as always so i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did like comment subscribe if you are new comment down below and let me know what do you think about the red eye right now it's sitting in new mexico while we wait for all the paperwork and then all that stuff is taking a little longer because of the little immense stuff that was in there literally let me know what y'all think about it does it look nasty to you how it look nasty to me because it honestly looks disgusting y'all comment down below and let me know but i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video y'all please like comment subscribe if you're new go down and smash that like button if you haven't already then subscribe and turn on post notifications and i'm gonna catch y'all in the next one peace bye y'all